Hi, I'm Nicholas Sparks. I'm the author of The Notebook, A Walk to Remember, Message in a Bottle, Dear John, and most recently, See Me, and I'm here at Audible. I grew up loving a great story. So it was always in my mind that I wanted to become a writer, and yet I never really had the belief that I could become a writer in the sense that I could pay my bills. When I was 28 then, I'd had a couple of novels under my belt and it hit me that it was time to chase a dream. So I worked from nine to midnight, four or five days a week, maybe a few hours on the weekend, and the notebook was finished in about six months. Inspiration can come from anywhere, including my, my own life. Message in a Bottle was inspired by my father after the death of my mother. A Walk to Remember was the story inspired by my sister. So you pull bits and pieces from people that you know. For the most part, it takes a couple of months to conceive of a story. I start with a small inspiration that can either be a theme or an event in my past. And little by little, I stack further ideas on that until I reach the point where I'm fairly clear on what I want the novel to be. The writing process, it usually is about six months long. It's an average of four days a week. And when I sit down to write, I write 2,000 words, and that can take anywhere from four to seven hours. See Me is most similar to Safe Haven or The Guardian in that it really explores the theme of love and danger. For See Me, I wanted a different kind of suspense and tension that builds toward the end. And so it's a very twisty mystery thriller. With that said, of course, See Me is also a love story. It is, in the end, two stories in one. It's a film that, of course, I love, and it's a film that has become regarded as a modern classic. I guess it's because everything about that film worked. Nick Cassavetes had an amazing view of what he wanted the film to be, and of course Nick was the director, and then you had amazing performances. It was a story that had both an epic quality, but captured the intimacy of that young, passionate love. If you want to be a writer, you have to be willing to put up with the challenges of being a writer. The uncertainty, the writer's block, the sleepless nights, the the loneliness, the ability to work in silence, the ability to give up time in the real world for time in a fantasy world. I want to entertain, I want to enthrall, I want to have a story that's interesting and original, a story that's memorable, and I want those stories to include characters that strike the reader as authentic and honest.